Hello everyone, I'm Crumbs. Welcome back to Lamplighters League. We are down at the docks where we will rendezvous with the pilots and uh, get out of here. So let's sneak up here. Okay, recon mode. We I think we had a quick look at this in uh, in the first episode. We can actually, if we press R, we can move the camera freely. And we can also hover over enemies, or actually all all persons and different things to see what it is. We have a dynamite crate. We have an enforcer that is on guard and his abilities is burst fire. Then we have the pilot, Captain Nicky, precision shot and evade. And these two ugly ones are, their ability is a melee ability with slice. So we just need to keep them away from us and we're good. All right, let's get out of recon mode. Still nothing, Lady Castro. Maybe you got the location wrong? They will be here and the deck with them. Doubt me again, and the next entrails I read will be yours. Science. Lady Nicastro is a deadly adversary. When science like her are on the field, there is no shame in running to live and fight another day. Okay, she'll, so she is probably pretty badass then. Will do a lot of damage. The escape route is the airplane at the end of the dock. Reach it to escape. And don't forget the pilot. I'll try. You move up here. So that crate could be really good to shoot. Okay, they are coming down here. Maybe we can take a whole bunch here. I want to move you up a little bit so we can use you in melee. They actually stopped there. Okay, let's do. Let's go here. And we go into uh, turn-based mode. So I think we start by shooting the crate. What will happen? Let's tab to move around. Okay. It looks like all three are inside, actually. So let's take this shot. Three knockdowns. We're not for sale at the moment. We didn't kill them, but they are almost dead. All three. Let's start with these two, because I think you are the one who has the best chance to take them out. So I will add this one as first target and that one as the second. And we got them both. Uh, Ingrid, can you... Yeah, yeah. Let's move over there and make contact. So we can use the pilot as well. We're with L. You must be the pilot. Sure am. Allies in the field. And we'll scram. Let's have a look at the pilot, Captain Nikki. You have smoke bombs, precision shot, and evade, just as Ingrid. So we need to take this guy out. And we have this. You have two shots left. Well, you can't kill her with two shots. And you don't kill him with one. So let's let's go for him. Two shots. We need to take him out so he is out of the picture. You will take a shot. Yeah, 50%. You hit him. Or her. Wherever it is. And we will evade. And then Latif. Let's set up an overwatch here. Where will you... Let's do it like that. Think you're fast. We don't know Let's where see. she's running, right? Oh, here is the... The sign. Enough. Oh! My sword she's poisoned. She threw a dart or whatever it was. Oh, nice! Well, you have this. Um, yeah, I want to use it. Let's give her some damage. What are you waiting for? To the aeroplane, quick!
I, I will move. I will run this way. We flank them that way. And just then, let's see if you have this decoy ability. So if we move here, we use it, and then we move away Blink, and hide. Miss me. So hopefully they will attack the decoy instead of us, Captain Nikki. Forty percent is not that good. Let's use evade here. And Ingrid, you're taking some damage. Let's go here and evade. And let's see what the enemies are doing. She didn't go for this? the decoy? Some kind of a, a gas, maybe? The decoy is still there, it looks kind of strange, but uh... Alright, Captain Nicky. Yeah, let's let's move here, we need to uh, do some shooting. Wait, Cap why can't you? No target in range! Well, you have. Um, okay, that, so the range is short then. I will use the evade. Uh, I will actually move you up. You could go here. And then evade. Let's see. Can you get in a better position and do some shooting instead? Um, no, you're too far away. Let's get over here. We will do some shooting next turn. Yeah, it's... I don't know, man. It's... Uh, we could get up behind him here and punch a little bit. But I'm afraid of her. I will move here. Evade. There it is. And... Latif. Let's go here. You are have no cover whatsoever, but let's do an overwatch. And of course she evaded. You will never nice, she went for aeroplane. Okay, that actually worked. We were very lucky. That didn't work. And neither did that. Worthy adversaries. You want the Andron? Take it! Sign retract. Did she? It. She disappeared. Two enemies remains. Okay, let's. Uh, where is our friend here? Can you do some shooting? We can. Forty-five. That ain't that good. I think it's better to uh, to move up behind them. Do we want cover? Maybe it's better here. Let's see, hopefully it's a little better than 45. It's 75. That is 45. So you take two shots on that guy. And he's still alive. Yeah, I, I wanna... Hmm. Nine percent. Got a hit. You will punch him from there. And man, he's still alive. Alright, let's go here. You have the evade, which is good. You shoot him in the back. Gentlemen, Jin of Cairo. Hot damn! 
What will the last one do? He runs away and misses. You need. You don't need to reload. That means that we can move. So you move here, and they shoot him twice. No, you only had one shot left. Okay. But you should be. Let's see, Ingrid. And we got it. Area cleared. This way. So do we yeah, you need to Well, I don't think we need to heal here, but That's let's do it good. anyway, and then you can not bad. pick up some fresh I'll bandages and everyone is Almost, you have a sliver there, but I guess it's fine. Everyone on board, or I'm leaving without you. We just saved you. Go, go, go. Here we are, Del Vasto's Landing. Now we find out what kind of man pays this well for a blank deck of playing cards. Wouldn't mind knowing who the hell we were fighting back in Marseille. Never seen troops like that before. Let's see what this Mr. L has to say for himself. A lovely little Mediterranean island you have here, Mr. L. I assume you are Mr. L? I have that dubious privilege. Welcome, Mr. Lejeune, Ms. Erickson, Mr. Sawyer. Do you have the undrawn hand? We have a package for you. What's inside, we can say, of course. Ah, of course. Regardless, that deck of cards is key to your next job for me. Slow down, pal. Who says we're interested in a next job? The last one burned your courier, and those two saw the body. Then you three may divvy his pay among yourselves, and I'll sweeten the pot for this next one. Fifty percent. You sound desperate. Okay, Mr. L, I'll humor you. What do you want us to do? In a word, sabotage. I'm in a race, you see. A race to find an ancient ruin, a tower. You may know it under one of its other names. The Axis Mundi. The World Tree. The Tower of Babel. Oh, you're an archaeologist then. That's disappointing. <laughs> I am no archaeologist, Monsieur Le Jin. And my rivals in this race are even less so. I want to preserve the tower. My enemies want to ransack it. It cannot be allowed to fall into their hands. But it can fall into yours, huh? And the gal with the sword. She's one of these rivals? Zorana Nicastro. Yes. She and two others. A nobleman and an industrial tycoon. Each is the scion of their own <laughs> noble house. Collectively, they call themselves the Banished Court. Science of the Banished Court. Mm-hmm. And how close are they to finding the tower? They've already found it. You said you were in a race. I was. And I lost. But I'm not out of the fight yet. My enemies have yet to enter the tower. It is a... dangerous place. And their preparations are incomplete. I want you three to sabotage their efforts until I can find the tower myself. Sabotage, huh? You have a target in mind? My sources have identified an outpost belonging to another of the court's three leaders. The tycoon, Trace Marteau. Marteau. Isn't that the famous American industrialist? The one who's always in the papers? The very same. I want you to infiltrate his outpost, sabotage a machine you'll find at the center, and return to me. Sabotage requires a subtle hand. You'll need me. In the spirit of charity, I accept. You'll need me too. But if the other two scions are anything like Nicastro, I ain't risking my neck for free. Mr. Sawyer is right. Double our fee, Mr. L, and we'll get to work. Double it is. And please, call me Locke.
Delvastos Landing. Welcome to Delvastos Landing. This tiny Mediterranean island serves as Locke's, uh, Locke's hideout, a place to take refuge from his enemies and plan his next moves. Now it will do the same for the agents in his employ. Navigate to the world map in the menu at the top of the screen to plan the agent's next move. Let's have a little look what we have here. We have supplies. Is that intel probably? Heal. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. That is skill points, I believe. So we can see. Let's head over to the agents. The agent screen. Use this to view to manage the scoundrels in locks. Employ by equipping them to prepare them for the next mission and spending skill points to unlock new tricks of the trade. So, we have a total of six skill points. And we can spread it out to use them to all the, th all the agents. So, let's use one for you. Stick and move. We have a push kick. That's causing knockdown. That's actually pretty good. And then we have the passive overwatch ability. It performs a melee attack on any adjacent enemies performing a hostile action. That is actually a pretty good passive one. Since she can only fight melee, right? She doesn't have any weapons, uh, any like guns or such. Any ranged weapons. I say I go with this one. Let's see what the other guys... We have three points left. So distract, blind the two enemies in the area. I don't know. Light him up. Range ability attacks up to four agents. If the ammo allows it, hit targets or flushed out of the current locations, banning cover. That is pretty good for only one point. I'll take it. Bull's eye. A devastating shot that is guaranteed to hit. Plus 15% chance of crit and deals double damage. Passive ability upon manually activating the reload ability and it gains 20% crit chance until the end of the round. Yeah, I'd, we need so many bullets for this. I'm, I'm thinking more of the kick. Or we can use one this one no let's uh let's let's go for the quick and uh we will use the next points for latif uh we also have a supplier away, could you? and we can buy different things do we have let's see you have a bandage so have you and you have nothing so we could actually let's buy a, a firebomb. That was nice. And we give that to Eddie. There we go. Alright, let's head to the world map. The next mission. This is world map Locke uses to plan his secret war against the signs of the banished court. Use it to track the court's progress and plan the agent's next move. So I guess we were in the Mediterranean. We can't really see where we are, right? But I guess this is the next mission. Phenomena. The Faithful. This mission introduces a new type of enemies. Scourges. Trial run sabotage. Destroy generator. From automobiles to home radios to government military contracts. Morto Industries has its fingers in every pie. This is a critical mission. Right, I guess we, we will rock on. So assign agents. And I guess we can we want to change anything. We don't need to change any equipment. We'll just start the mission. My three new agents succeeded in retrieving the undrawn hand despite Surana and Castro's interference. Now they are en route to a uh, Marto Industries compound with orders to destroy a piece of machinery. My informants traced to the site. Machinery that, if I'm correctly, plays a role in the company's mysterious project Crossroads. Almost as important as the mission itself, 
In the question, will the unruly hand respond to their actions? All right. This generator Mr. Locke wants us to destroy is just up ahead. From stealing blank cards to destroying machinery, Locke is a strange one. That's for sure. Enough wind jamming. Let's do this job and get out. Let's go into recon mode here and see what we have. There are some stuff up here. So. Okay, the generator is over there. So we are <laughs> up on a roof somewhere. Well, I guess we, we're going to sneak away down there. Let's exit recon mode. How, can we climb over here? Yeah, I guess we can. Newspaper article. Trace Martou on fame, fortune, and the fashion of the future. Now, don't tell me you still wear sock garters. Mr. Martou flashes me an accusatory wink while nursing a $100 glass of 1865 Catronia rye. Must I beg you to get with the times? By the end of our interview, I'm proud owner of five new pairs of Ryan socks and top of the line Morto Electrolife automatic coffee pot. And I've gotten a rare glimpse into life of a man so fantastically wealthy that as he stands to go, uh, it's on to a Griffith Ox Observatory gala for this module. He pours his untouched Catriona rye into a nearby fountain. Okay. Let's head over here. I can see we have some. Oh. What do we have here? Should we see if we can take out a few uh, stealthy? So let's change to Eddie. You move over there. You go in the corner and we use Latif's sneaking ability here. Recruited from the disillusioned masses, enforcers impose the banished court's will with semi-automatic rifles and satchel charges, the most numerous of all the court's forces, but no less dangerous for it. All right, Enforcer, we met one before and there is one on guard as well. Shock troops and flankers, the court's scourges move quickly to stun and overwhelm their enemies. They push agents into obstacles, okay. So maybe this is a bad idea to go there. Okay, let's use you to climb up here and grab what's what's over there. And then we see if we can... Well, if we don't need to go for those. Don't mind if I do. What do we have here? Smoke bombs. We don't have room to collect that yet. We only have one room for one. Each so far. All right, let's climb down, and I think we go for uh, for that one because I don't think we look at those. Whoa! Someone is coming. Oh no! Can we? Get it? Oh crap! Um, I wonder if they will hear us. Can we, if I move here, then I guess he will run and hopefully he'll move this way. No, he didn't. Okay. Let's, let's use our new ability here. I hate the clingy ones. And then we have you. Yeah, shoot him in the back. This is how a master thief does it. And another one. He's still alive. I'm a little worried. Well, I guess we you will just use both. That was disappointing and Eric easy. Here. Okay, we What's were next? very lucky there. Roll out. Oh, they heard something. Let's run away. Will they see the body? Are they coming over here? Yeah, let's uh, let's head over here and we see if we can do some 
fanatics willing to die for the banished court and its magisters. Acolyte ceremonial daggers are razor sharp, and their dedication to the court is absolute. Yeah, we need to be careful. Maybe that is not the best way to go. Today's news. Search continues for aviators kidnapped son FBI now involved. Are they coming closer? Yeah, we need to be careful there. You go here. Oh, we have some a patrol. You hide there. You have that. We can't shoot at these actually. I will cover our backs here in case they come that way, but no, it looks good. So we could probably take that one out if we sneak up behind and use a uh, sucker punch. Take down. Is this a. Oh, you, yeah, you can. That one's down. Oh, crap. They are coming. Yeah, I think we it's time to start, right? If we shoot that one. You are a little bit too far away, but it looks like there are only four here. And I think this is a good Well, I'm not sure. Let's let's take this. I'm going to go for this one. And let's go into tactical and go. That's one. Enemies alerted. They actually came closer, which is good. So you take another shot, 100%. Sometimes I amaze even myself. That is gone. And should we use this right away? Uh, yeah. If I go there, all three will burn. What's this? Light them up. Attacks four enemies. No. <laughs> we don't want to shoot that one. But maybe this. This is how we say hello. Hey, not bad. <laughs> I might learn a thing or two from you. And that's, that's why Uncle Sam pinned the medal on me back in 18. Yeah, let's go for let's go for that one. And I don't think you're in fire. You actually got a XP back. Mm. You would probably come out. Let's move behind here and use the evade. Enemies remaining five. Did it say that? Are these guys coming? No, it looks like they are. Oh, they're over here. I see. Well, we should be able to... kill you and I'm thinking I want to move you back here I don't think they will they will run through here well let's just do that we can move you oh man I want to go here but okay I guess we're going here you have almost full ammo. Let's set up an overwatch here. I don't think they will come. And you have two. Well, let's uh, head over there. Nice. OK, 
Okay, we have one here. So, as long as we use the evade ability, I think we're good. Can you get in a decent spot? Or we can use Overwatch. I don't want you to start burn. And you have no cover there whatsoever. Let's let's go here. And Overwatch. And I guess we can take one shot and then over oh do you need to reload yeah i only have one bullet left uh let's reload Reloading. and overwatch Time to put on a show. Ah, okay that's not i was hoping that one oh you hit him or her but He's still alive. Oh, took some damage. You're moving forward. Evade, please. Thank you. So, should you... We could use the decoy. And it's time for me to go. And then you can... Oh, you can go for the machine, actually. 45, 60. Yeah. Let's hope they attack that one. Where do we want to send you? Forty-five. Thirty-five. 35. No, I... Let's hope that that guy is moving and we can do First that. First sign of movement. Yeah, you can you can hit him twice actually. What do you think this generator does? Don't know. But it looks like it's leaking. Yeah, we won't kill him. So, evade. Oh, someone took a lot of damage. Oh, it was the decoy, hopefully. Yeah, they're going for the decoy. I don't think so. And that, she used the new passive ability. Oh, crap. Yeah, it's, I guess it's fine. Um, should we use the... Let's do a regular punch first. I charge extra for this. And then we use the kick. Save some for me, will you? Let's nice. Ways. And you got one action point left, so we can actually take out the generator. That's it. The target is in ruins. Time to start scoping out the exits. You have two bullets left. You have one. Well, I guess we'll reload. So the question is... 90%. 60, alright. No. Oh, I don't want to shoot at those. Ah, oh, skip. So... Wanna dance? Flushed out. And you have two. Yeah, hundred percent. Never saw it coming. Not bad. And we won't kill him. Who did? Did you shoot at that one? I think so. 
Let's reload and then we take him out, hopefully. And that is that. Area cleared. So what? Do we have anything of interest here? Yeah, there's something down there. Is it? Yeah, okay, it's med... Medication. Let's heal up and then you grab this. Do we have anything over there? Is something? A smoke bomb. Well, since I guess it could be good to have. What is this? Moat. Moat of fate. Pace is wild. Oh, a new card. Let me hold on to this. Got some supplies and some lore. Typed on the court letterhead to all court officers regarding kill list. The individuals listed below have been identified as enemies of the banished court. They are to be hunted down and eliminated at your earliest opportunity. Updates to this list will be provided regularly as operations proceed. The Council of Magisters. Okay. Well, I guess we are... <laughs> yeah, we need to uh, get over there uh, where we started. So we're probably going to use some of these cool gadgets. Let's just get up, everyone. Get them together. And uh, I think we, uh, we will do that in the next episode because it's time to end here. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.